Top 25 Most Popular Italian Foods and Dishes Pizza, Lasagna, Spaghetti, and Gelato are all familiar foods. These are just a few of the exquisite cuisines that originated in Italy and are enjoyed worldwide. Let's go on a gastronomic excursion through this boot-shaped peninsula, from north to south, to which your hunger with the sound of a fork. If not yet, remember to like, share, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell. Number 1. Risotto. Risotto is a traditional northern Italian meal that can be prepared in countless ways. It's creamy and full of cheese, and it's made with northern rice kinds including arborio, carnaroli, and violone, which are cooked gently in broth. The risotto alla milanese, which is made with white wine, parmesan cheese, butter, onions, and saffron, which gives it its distinctive yellow hue, is one of the most popular. However, different ingredients like pumpkin, red radicchio, mushrooms, sausage, or seafood can be used. Number 2. Pizza. The first pizza was made in Naples, southern Italy, near the end of the 18th century in honor of Margherita di Savoia, Queen of Italy. It has a high cornicione, edge, on the outside and a lower core, and it is rigorously baked in a wood-fired oven. If we're talking about Italian food, pizza is unavoidable, it's a national emblem, a food that represents Italy around the world, and it's been designated as an intangible cultural heritage of humanity by UNESCO. Every pizza maker has their own secrets, and each pizza, which is created from flour, water, brewer's yeast, and salt, can be stuffed or topped in a variety of ways. With its tomato sauce, mozzarella, and basil, the pizza margarita is the most famous and basic of pizzas, evoking the colors of the national flag. Number 3. Pasta. Pasta is another sign, a national icon that is loved all over the world. Born in Sicily, it quickly expanded its manufacturing to neighboring seaside locations that at the time had ports and a suitable temperature for product drying. Naples and Imperia are two of the most well-known places. However, Rome became the metropolis of spaghetti and the birthplace of spaghetti alla carbonara. It came about practically by accident, thanks to the inventiveness of a young bologna cook who combined bacon, egg yolk, milk, cream, and cheese. Bacon, egg yolk, and cheese are now included in the recipe, which hasn't altered much over the years. In the Italian capital, Bucatini al Cacio e Pepe are also popular. The key is to combine them at the appropriate times. The penne alla rubiata pasta with a spicy tomato sauce, is another popular pasta dish. Another popular Italian pasta dish is tagliatella al ragù, which is made with long cooked meat and tomato sauce and originated in bologna. Number 4. Gnocchi. We had to follow the pasta with gnocchi, another traditional Italian meal. Gnocchi are little potato dough rounds. Each location has its own twist, although cheese, spinach, eggs, and a variety of sauces are the most common ingredients. Number 5. Pesto alla Genovese. Pesto is a delight from the Ligurian city of Genoa. A simple sauce made with seven key ingredients, Genoese basil up, extra virgin olive oil preferably from the Ligurian Riviera, Parmesan cheese, Pecorino cheese, pine nuts, garlic, and salt. Perfect for seasoning dry and packed pasta, as well as croutons. Number 6. Lasagna. Lasagna is another staple of Italian cuisine. Layers of fresh spaghetti are topped in bechamel sauce and the famous ragu bolognese in this baked dish from bologna. Slowly and for a long time, a sauce made of sautéed celery, onion, and carrot is added to chunks of beef, pig, and concentrated tomato. Number 7. Gelato, ice cream. It is a traditional Italian dish that is enjoyed all year. It is consumed during walks, as a snack, or as a dessert after a meal. There are hundreds of varieties, and it is more consistent and richer than other semifreddos. It will not be difficult to identify locations in Italy that do it correctly. Number 8. Prosciutto di Parma, Parma Ham. The kingdom of preserved meats is Italy. The cured raw ham, which is normally served as an appetizer, stands out among the famed mortadella, salami, copa, and culatello. It's also good as a snack or a main course when cut into thin slices and served with piadina, gnocco, or torta fritta, tigella, grissini, focaccia, pita, machetta, mafalda, perizzo, or biga, depending on the city. Each region has its unique type of ham, although Parma is the most well-known. It's a DOC product with a distinct sweetness and its crown, the trademark insignia, which is only present on the original, is stamped with fire. It must also undergo stringent tests in order to be certified genuine. Number 9. Rivoli. 
Ribolita is a country soup from Tuscany that dates back to the Middle Ages and is a symbol of impoverished people's diet. According to legend, peasant families in those days were numerous and unable to afford meat, so they made enormous quantities of soup with the items accessible in the countryside. To increase the volume, they also added bread. The soup was kept for several weeks and warmed several times. Today, it's a tasty, quick to prepare dish that combines veggies, beans, herbs, olive oil, and Parmesan cheese with dry bread pieces. Number 10. Bagna Cotta. Bagna Cotta, translated from the dialect, hot sauce, is a traditional Piedmontese meal made with extra virgin olive oil, anchovies, and garlic that is reduced to a sauce after extended cooking. In the autumn, it is utilized as a dip for fresh vegetables and has been designated as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. It's a heavy dish, thus it's classified as a main course, but it can also be served as an appetizer. It's more than just food, it's a ritual, a convivial moment of sharing among the guests, who all eat from the same terracotta pot. Number 11. Polenta. It is a basic meal composed of maize flour from all parts of northern Italy, with origins dating back to the days of ancient Rome. Polenta is prepared in slices, even fried, to be served at the table without seasoning or as a side dish with a variety of meats, butter, soft cheeses, fish, or sauce-heavy dishes. Number 12. Tortelli and Ravioli. In Italy, the stuffed pasta family is quite big. Almost every location, from north to south, has its unique preparation. And many are well-known such as Emilia's tortellini, made of pork with prosciutto and mortadella and served in a meat broth, and the dry tortelli, stuffed with herbs, pumpkin, or potatoes and served with butter and cheese. Piedmont's Agnoletti del Plain, packed with a variety of meats and vegetables, are eaten with roast sauce or butter and sage. Traditional Ligurian ravioli are stuffed with tomato sauce meat, chard, and borage, or filled with fish. Number 13. Focaccia. The elements that have decreed the success of focaccia, a cuisine that began in Liguria but has conquered Italy and the world with its endless number of variations, are a modest mixture of flour, water, yeast, and salt, with a final touch of olive oil. An ancient recipe that necessitates the use of high-quality flour and oil, as well as the manual dexterity of those who prepare and manipulate the dough in a very hot oven. Number 14. Arancini. Arancini is a must-try Sicilian delicacy that is ideal for enjoying when out for a stroll. These are breaded and fried rice balls stuffed with beef sauce, peas, and cheese. Every bite is a true delight since it is tasty and appetizing. Number 15. I formaggi, the cheeses. How can we forget about Italian cheeses, national treasures that have traveled the globe? They can be enjoyed on their own, at any moment throughout the meal, or as a complement to a variety of foods. Parmigiano Reggiano, a hard dop cheese made from raw cow's milk, partially skimmed, with no additives, and with a production area that includes the provinces of Reggio Emilia, Modena, Parma, and Bologna, are among the many. Number 16. Il Tartufo, the truffle. Italian truffles add a distinct flavor to appetizers, meats, and mushrooms, and they're also used as flakes in some side dishes. Truffles are as pricey as they are tasty, and are known for their extravagance. White truffles are the most well-known and sought after, and they can be found in Alba, Piedmont, where you can sample delectable delicacies and take part in a truffle festival. Number 17. Ponzerotto Frito, Fried Ponzerotto. Crispy on the outside and soft on the inside, a little crescent of pizza dough filled with mozzarella and tomato. It can be purchased and eaten hot as a snack in the alleys of Bari or in countless varieties in any rotisserie throughout Puglia. The Ponzerotto comes from the 17th century and was created by a housewife who used the few ingredients she had on hand to create a culinary wonder. Number 18. Fiorentina. The most famous Italian beef steak is named after the city where it was created, Florence. The authentic Fiorentina is manufactured from canina breed specimens. The meat must be aged for around 20 days before being sliced into a typical T-bone steak. It must adhere to a certain weight and cut specifications, as well as cooking times and methods, and must be kept rare. There are no aromatics in this dish, and coarse salt is only added at the very end. Number 19. Minestrone. Minestrone is a dish that links the country from the far north to the extreme south. Until the 1970s, it was a symbol of the Italian eating. It's a soup made from a variety of veggies that varies by location, and it's sometimes served with rice or pasta. Even if the word minestrone has come to be associated with a lot of mixing and a lot of misunderstanding, it is still a wonderful and nourishing dinner. 
Number 20. Frico. Let us travel to Friuli Venezia Giulia to sample some traditional frico. It's a form of omelet made with onions, butter, and Montasio cheese, a local semi-hard cheese created from cow's milk, cooked in a skillet and served as a single dish. There is a soft and a crunchier variety. It was a common dish among woodcutters and farmers, who brought it with them to work in the fields. Number 21. Arastasini. Abruzzo is known for its arastasini, which are a type of pasta. They're little bits of lamb meat impaled on a stick and roasted or barbecued. It's a quick and easy to prepare dinner that can also be taken away. Number 22. Olive Ascolante, Ascoli Olives. They're giant olives that have been stuffed with meat and then fried, and they're from the Marche region. This dish comes from the 19th century, when noble family cooks created this filling to use up the vast amounts of beef they had on hand. Number 23. Sardine and Sur. Sur means flavor, and this basic dish of fried sardines seasoned with vinegar and sweet and sour onions speaks for itself. Sardines in Sur are a Venetian institution. Number 24. Frito Misto Piedmontese. This is one of Piedmontese cuisine's most well-known dishes. Originally served as an appetizer, several new pieces have been added over the years to make it more suited as a second course. It may appear to be a simple dish to prepare, but it is not, the cooking times vary, but everything should be freshly cooked and served sizzling hot. There should be at least 18 pieces, both savory and sweet. Fruit and vegetables are added along with various cuts of meat such as veal, pork sausages, lamb chops, grains, liver, and sweetbreads. Everything is fried after being breaded. Number 25. Tiramisu. And finally, Dulci in Fundo. Last but not least, we round up this culinary tour of Italian tables with one of the country's most famous and envied sweets, now famous around the world. Thank you for watching, remember to like, share, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell.